Hello everyone, this is Ryan Moore with VideoTech, uh, providing you with another unique offering called our NXW. These special stainless steel enclosures are designed to operate in extremely high temperatures, such as blast furnaces, foundries, or other high extreme temperature applications. Uh, I'll discuss why and how these can be installed, and touch base on where you likely need this as a solution. So the NXW housing is constructed from our electro-polished 316L stainless steel, consists of a body with a double chamber for the circulation of either air or, or liquid. Up to 180 degrees Fahrenheit or 80 degrees Celsius, you can utilize air to cool the enclosure. However, any application that requires above that temperature range must utilize liquid to properly cool the enclosure. The unit when cooled with liquid was tested and verified up to 400 C or 750 degrees Fahrenheit. Now while you're utilizing liquid, uh, you typically need to create a circuit or a cascade of chillers to confirm that this is the correct cooling temperature. We do offer a conversion chart so you can calculate either the air or water flow, flow intake and, and temperature along with the environmental and internal housing temperature. Now as a standard, uh, the NXW enclosure is equipped with an air barrier. It's designed for keeping the glass clean for dust and dirt deposits. And additionally, it may offer an extra cooling for the front window. Now for the NXW, there's three choices when it comes to the type of glass. You have tempered glass for the operating temperature of 260 C or 500 degrees Fahrenheit. You have quartz glass with the operating temperature of 400 C or 752 degrees Fahrenheit. Or you have IR proof glass for the operating temperature of 260 C or 500 degrees Fahrenheit with an IR radiation transmitted at 21%. So each glass plays an important role per solution. So for example, if you have an application where you need to install a camera that uh, monitors an oven that has direct flames, you would typically want to choose the IR proof glass to avoid the camera lens from any damages. And you want to think about a mask for welders where they have the visible range that passes through but reflects a large part of the infrared. Now additionally, we do offer a selection of glass for applications for thermal cameras. So for your typical standard thermal camera, we offer a zinc selenium glass, which has a wavelength of 7.5 to 14 microns for applications in environments up to 200 C or 500 degrees Fahrenheit. And then for shortwave thermal cameras, we, which are often used for uh, thermal analysis of high temperature processes, a sapphire glass with a wavelength of 0.75 to 4.5 microns and an operating temperature up to 400 C or 752 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, here are some installation pictures where you can really understand why you would need a solution like the NXW for high temperature applications. Uh, it's important for the end user since installing a normal camera in these type of environments uh, the likelihood of that camera uh, performing for a long period of time is very minimum. And not only the cost to replace the camera, but let's say if you need to monitor uh, an oven 24-7 where it's important to have a crisp clear image of your target, having a camera installed in these liquid cooled enclosures can guarantee to be the best solution for the hot and harsh environments. Uh, so here we have the biggest cement factory in Hanau, Vietnam in the large picture. You see a liquid cooled housing that monitors a production processes for a pulp and paper process plant. Uh, additionally, like uh, power and utility, steel and gas, incineration, or petrochemical sectors are the industries that are typically going to utilize such a solution. And at VideoTech, we do offer a wide range of combinations of so parts, accessories, and brackets. So it's important to reach out to us to help you steer you right in the, into the right direction for your application. And uh, I want to say thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit our website at www.videotech.com or please reach out to your local sales representative.